Hello everybody, welcome back. My name is Sparks and I will be your lovely lab coated lecturing Let's Player for today. And today I have something a little interesting to show you. Um, I got distracted while working on some Game Mode 4 stuff and wondered whether it was possible to get a command block to uh, basically detect and uh, output based on its uh, on the signal strength of the redstone dust that's powering it. So I made this little uh, seven segment display uh, which takes uh, the redstone input signal strength and displays a number. So um, it actually takes the input strength minus one. So if we give it a signal strength of one, which is from this button over here, it'll output zero. And you can see that uh, as we get closer with our power, it will change the number up uh, across the seven segment display all the way from zero to uh, nine. There we go. Um, so the little catch is that this uh, basically is checking Every single command inside this command block, which is uh, summoned as a as a minecart just above the command block, you can see that when I push the button, each command is checking this exact spot for redstone dust and uh, and the exact signal strength of that dust, and then deciding whether to set quartz or not based on that signal strength, um, and then at the end all of the command blocks are, uh, the command block minecarts are killed. Um, so it's, it kind of works pretty well. The the one catch is that you have to power it from the northernmost side, uh, from the pot from the negative Z side here. Um, so if you tried to power it from any other direction, it wouldn't work. Um, the other other thing is that um, it needs its signal strength effectively needs to go to zero between presses. So if I push this one and then this one too quickly, you'll see that it didn't change to two because it was still being powered by three. Uh, this will happen even if your signal strength goes up. So uh, one to two won't work. Um, if you want to use this as a seven segment display, generally it's just a silly little thing, but if you wanted to, for example, if you, somebody wanted to learn about signal strength in redstone but didn't want to know how to build a seven segment display, this is kind of a nice little uh, go-between that handles the seven segment display but lets you play with regular redstone. Um, so if you wanted a system where uh, your signal strength is, strength is not going to go to zero between, for example a lever, say we're giving it a signal strength of two now and then we up it to four, you can see that this clock over here basically deal, uh, handles that for us. So this is just a, a redstone clock but importantly it maintains the signal strength um, that comes into it and uh, sends that signal strength out. Uh, and I'm just using a comparator here to point this dust at the command block without losing any strength. So you can use that if you want to handle it. Obviously a clock running is going to be a little laggier, but um, it will solve the issue of uh, your power level changing. So yeah, um, that's basically it. Thank you for watching. <laughs> I'll see you next time. Oh yeah, the series of commands in this command block are available from a paste bin in the video description.